The star closest to us is Proxima Centauri. The solar system has long been a subject of fascination for astronomers. Scottish astronomers discovered a red dwarf in 1915. Astronomer Robert Innes discovered it as part of the Alpha Centauri system, which also includes Alpha Centauri A and B. Despite its proximity, just 4.24 light years away, it remains undetectable to the naked eye due to its relatively low brightness. Proxima Centauri contains a wealth of scientific value, particularly as the host of an orbiting exoplanet known as Proxima b, within the star's habitable zone. Smaller red dwarfs like Proxima Centauri are cooler and much longer-lived than stars similar to our sun. Their low luminosity results in not only difficulty observing them, but also signifies that their habitable regions are much closer to the star. This is equivalent to an orbital distance of just 0.05 astronomical units, a small portion of the distance between Earth and the Sun. This proximity exposes Proxima b to intense stellar activity, including frequent solar flares and high levels of radiation, making its surroundings starkly different from Earth's. The discovery of Proxima b was a significant accomplishment in exoplanet research. Using the radial velocity method, astronomers found subtle wobbles in Proxima Centauri's position caused by the gravitational pull of the orbiting planet. These wobbles enabled researchers to estimate the planet's mass and orbital period. In now uh, 2016, the European Southern Observatory officially confirmed the existence of Proxima b, a significant advance in the search for worlds that might be habitable beyond our planetary system. While ground-based observations have provided valuable insights into Proxima b, they come with significant limitations. Light and atmospheric distortion interference hinder the ability of Earth-based telescopes to capture detailed data about the planet's surface or atmosphere. The majority of the data, including its mass, distance from the star, and orbital characteristics, relies on indirect measurements. To find deeper truths about Proxima b's environment and how it might affect life, more advanced observational instruments like the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, are essential. The function of Proxima Centauri as a gateway to understanding exoplanetary systems cannot be overstated. As the closest star system to Earth, it offers a unique opportunity to study life-sustaining conditions. Proxima b, in particular, embodies an enticing possibility. A rocky, Earth-sized planet with the potential to harbor water and maybe even life. However, the challenges posed by its harsh environment make it a difficult problem for scientists to solve. The James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, is not just another tool in the arsenal of astronomy. It is a revolution. Designed as the successor to the Hubble Space Telescope, JWST was envisioned to address the limitations of its predecessor and push the boundaries of human understanding. While Hubble provided invaluable insights into the cosmos, its capabilities are constrained by its focus on visible and ultraviolet light. JWST, in contrast, is built to observe the universe in infrared wavelengths, allowing it to peer through cosmic dust and uncover phenomena invisible to Hubble. One of the most important design features of JWST is its primary mirror, an astonishing 6.5 meters in diameter, more than twice as large as Hubble's mirror. This larger mirror enables JWST to collect significantly more light, allowing it to observe very faint and faraway objects. The mirror, coated with a thin layer of gold to enhance its infrared reflectivity, is made up of 18 hexagonal segments that work together to create a platform for highly sensitive observation. Another groundbreaking innovation is the sunshield layer of the JWST, which keeps the telescope's instruments at a constant temperature of about 233 degrees. This extremely chilly environment is essential for detecting faint infrared signals without interference from the telescope's own heat. Unlike Hubble, which orbits Earth, JWST operates from the second Lagrange point, L2, a stable position approximately 1.5 million kilometers from our planet. 
This location minimizes interference caused by Earth's heat and light, enabling JWST to conduct continuous observations. The telescope can study everything from the earliest galaxies to exoplanet atmospheres, like that of Proxima b. Its focus on infrared light is particularly significant as it allows astronomers to study red-shifted objects whose light has been stretched to longer wavelengths as the universe expands. JWST's capabilities extend much further than mere observation. It is designed to answer some of the most profound questions in science, including the origins of galaxies, the formation of stars, and the conditions that might support extraterrestrial life. With its cutting-edge equipment, including the near-infrared, Camera, NIARCAM, the mid-infrared instrument, MIRI, and the near-infrared spectrograph, NIAR-SPEC, JWST is not only a telescope, but also a time machine, a laboratory, and a beacon of human ingenuity. Proxima b has captivated scientists and the public alike as a potential second Earth. Situated within the habitable zone of its star, the planet has the right conditions to potentially support liquid water a key ingredient for life as we know it. With a mass roughly 1.17 times that of Earth, Proxima b is likely a rocky planet similar in composition to our own. Its proximity to Earth, just over four light years away, makes it an ideal target for investigating the possibility of life beyond our solar system. However, Proxima b is far from being a perfect twin to Earth. One of its most striking features is that it is tidally locked, meaning one side of the planet is in perpetual daylight while the other is in perpetual darkness. This creates a unique environment with extreme temperature differences between the two hemispheres. The region where day and night meet may provide a small twilight zone with conditions moderate enough to support life. The challenges posed by Proxima B's environment are significant. Its host star, Proxima Centauri, is a red dwarf known for its intense solar flares, which can emit bursts of X-rays and ultraviolet rays. These flares could strip away the planet's atmosphere over time, exposing its surface to the harshness of space. If Proxima b retains any atmosphere, it likely requires a strong magnetic field to shield it from radiation. Without such protection, the environment on the surface would be hostile to life as we know it. Despite these challenges, scientists are hopeful about the possibility of life on Proxima b. The planet's position within the habitable zone suggests that liquid water could exist, either on its surface or in subsurface reservoirs. Life might adapt to the harsh environment in the same way organisms thrive in extreme environments on Earth, such as hydrothermal vents in the deep sea or high radiation zones. These adaptations could include subsurface habitats, resistance to radiation, or unique biochemical processes. On Proxima b, the search for life is more than just a scientific endeavor. It is an endeavor to answer one of humanity's oldest questions. Are we alone in the universe? Proxima b represents a tantalizing possibility a rocky, Earth-like world that might have the necessary conditions for life. As our technology advances, so too does our ability to explore this intriguing planet and uncover its secrets. While Proxima b displays tantalizing possibilities, its environment is greatly affected by the nature of its host star, Proxima Centauri. Unlike our sun, Proxima. Centauri is a red dwarf star, cooler, smaller, and significantly less bright. Its lower size and temperature mean its habitable zone is much closer, pulling Proxima b into an orbit just 0.05 astronomical units from the star, about 20 times closer than Earth is to the Sun. This proximity creates a unique set of problems for the planet and any potential life it might host. One major issue is Proxima Centauri's stellar activity particularly its intense and frequent solar flares. These flares are powerful, sudden outbursts of energy that release high doses of X-rays and ultraviolet radiation. Such events are far more common and energetic in red dwarfs than in stars like our sun. 
This indicates constant high-energy particle bombardment at Proxima b, which could strip away the planet's atmosphere over time. Without a protective magnetic field, any atmosphere on Proxima b would be vulnerable to erosion, leaving its surface exposed to harsh radiation. Even if Proxima b retains a portion of its atmosphere, Proxima Centauri's radiation poses serious challenges to life. High levels of ultraviolet light can fracture molecular bonds, preventing the formation of complex organic compounds. This would severely limit the potential for life to develop or persist on the planet's surface. On Earth, organisms like Deinococcus radiodurans have evolved mechanisms to repair radiation-induced DNA damage, suggesting that life on Proxima b might similarly adapt. However, the level of radiation resistance required would be extreme, possibly necessitating entirely new biochemistries. Interestingly, Proxima b's tidally locked nature may offer some protection. While one side faces Proxima Centauri's constant radiation, the night side of the planet could serve as a refuge. Subsurface habitats or deep caves could protect life forms from the worst of the radiation. Similarly, if Proxima b has subsurface oceans, they could provide a stable, radiation-free environment in which microbes might thrive, much like the ecosystems around hydrothermal vents on Earth. Despite these challenges, scientists remain hopeful that Proxima b's extreme environment provides a unique opportunity to investigate the adaptability of life. By studying how organisms might survive, we can better understand the PO. Survive or even thrive under such conditions that researchers can use to improve understanding of what makes a planet habitable. Proxima b is more than just a natural choice for a permanent residence. It is a laboratory for evaluating the capabilities of the planet's proximity to life itself. Earth and its position within the habitable zone of its star make it an ideal candidate for further study. With new missions and telescopes, Proxima b will remain the focus on the horizon in the search for life beyond Earth. If we are to find evidence of extraterrestrial life, Proxima b might likely be our first stop for looking at it. It serves as an illustration that, even in the harshest environments, life may find a way. As we keep pushing, Proxima represents the limits of space exploration. Proxima b will continue to be an essential piece, providing clues regarding the potential for life in the cosmic backyard of our own. With continued investigation and observation, Proxima's mysteries may one day be uncovered, providing insight into the existence of life beyond our planet. The quest for life beyond Earth is a journey that extends beyond years, but generations. As technology advances and our knowledge of the universe expands, the search for habitable planets will maintain Proxima b. With its numerous challenges and possibilities, it stands as a symbol of the human desire to discover the unknown. Regardless of whether we discover signs of life on Proxima b, the pursuit of this goal will, without a doubt, lead to new insights and a deeper comprehension of the universe, a search that may one day reveal answers to one of humanity's most pressing concerns. Are we alone in the universe? As we continue to explore the cosmos, the discoveries we discuss, planets such as Proxima b, will serve as stepping stones for comprehending the broader possibilities for the search for life beyond our solar system. For habitable worlds both near and far, this has emerged as one of the most thrilling frontiers of contemporary science. Telescopes like the James Webb Space Telescope and developments in technology may one day allow us to respond to the age-old question of whether life exists anywhere else in the universe. The discoveries that lie ahead are not limited to just finding signs of life. Every new piece of data we gather helps us understand how planets evolve, how life might emerge, and under what circumstances are necessary for that life to flourish. It's a process that involves studying not only the planets themselves, but also their stars, their atmospheres, and even the cosmic events that shape them. As we expand our horizons into outer space, knowledge of the universe will continue to develop, changing our perspective on what the possibilities for Proxima b are.
With all its challenges, it exemplifies the complexity and wonder of this search. The planet may appear hostile in many ways, but that is precisely what makes it such an important target for study. The more we learn about Proxima b, the more we learn about the potential limits of habitability and the resilience of life. If life can survive such extreme conditions, it would expand the possibilities regarding where we might locate existence elsewhere in the universe. It is likely that space exploration in the future will bring us closer to answering these questions. The development of next-generation space missions and telescopes will allow us to look more closely at distant star systems and analyze discovered exoplanets in unprecedented detail. We may one day discover not only other planets that resemble Earth, but also evidence of life on those other planets, altering our understanding of life in the universe. In the meantime, Proxima b stands as a testament to the interest and determination of scientists and explorers. It is a world that invites us to imagine what lies beyond our own borders, what might be out there, and to continue striving for the answers to the most important questions that we can ask. Whether or not we find life on Proxima b, the pursuit of knowledge will continue to propel humanity forward, bringing about new innovations and inspiring future generations to explore the stars. Thus, the journey of discovery continues, and the search for life elsewhere in the universe is far from over. Every new mission, every new telescope, every new breakthrough brings us closer to understanding our place in the existence of life in the universe. Proxima b, beyond our planet, may be just one of many worlds that could one day be explored, but its role in shaping our scientific understanding is already profound. The quest for life, whether on Proxima b or on another distant planet, is a journey that brings us all together in our shared curiosity about the cosmos. As we continue our search, the hope of finding other forms of life remains one of the greatest aspirations of our species.